622 waking up across northeast Kansas. The temperature is in the middle 70s. Here's a live look outside this morning from our feathered friends here on our tower sky cam. The starlings are back. I've got 76 degrees in northern Shawnee County, a mixture of sunshine and clouds as the sun rose across northeast Kansas 16 minutes after six. A couple storms out there blowing from west to east across the area. Otherwise, we are dry and continue to dry things out between now and lunchtime. An excessive heat warning in the areas where you see the red color, the whole eastern half of northeast Kansas, west of the Flint Hills, including Manhattan and Junction City. You guys under a heat advisory later on today. It doesn't matter where you live. Very, very hot weather. In fact, I'm tracking the hottest day of 2015. So here we go with Future Track so you can plan your Friday tracking temperatures by your lunch break in the lower and middle 90s, running anywhere from 10 to 15 degrees above what we saw yesterday. Daytime high temperatures above the century mark as well. About 101 at a radar site later this afternoon in Alma, uh, Wabunsee County. It won't even feel that cool. In fact, when you factor in the humidity, this is what it will feel like. About 115, hence the excessive heat warning for the eastern half of the area. This is your day planner forecast. I am tracking your day temperatures by lunchtime in the middle to upper 80s, 95 by dinner time, but feeling more like 115 out there. Also tracking temperatures pretty humid tonight and very muggy, close to 80 degrees for lows. A slight chance for some more nocturnal thunderstorms, though, north of the highway. Matt Miller, he's in tonight, and he will be tracking that for you. Saturday and Sunday, a daytime thunderstorm is possible. Very hot and humid weather, though, over the weekend. Better storm chance on Wednesday. Natalie.